Hello YouTube, so this is our solar array. We've got about uh, 17 panels per row and they're all connected to a pole over here which makes them turn if you pull, push or pull it by hand so it can track the sun. So let me just show you how that works. So if I were to pull this one and the panels go that way, all of them, and then if I were to push it back, there you go, the other way. So, um, the plan was to connect a linear actuator on on this pole, and then with the LED solar tracker um, in the southwestern corner of one of the panels, so it can follow the sun. Um, so, I actually did that on one of the arrays. I'll just show you that right, right now. Um, I just came here to show you guys the mechanism that we use because the, the other one is connected to a linear actuator. Um, yeah, so I can't move that at the moment. But this I could this one I can still move by hand. But let me let me show you guys the, the mechanism that we used. Okay, so here you can see the linear actuator connected to the to the uh, solar tracker over there. Okay, so let me just walk you through the connections that I made. Um, yeah, we've got the four cables, two cables coming in from the battery, which go into the into the sensor. And then two of them coming out again, going all the way down here, and then they're connected to the cable of the linear actuator. So yeah. And then it just comes down, comes down, all the way to the positive and negative of a 12 volt battery. And uh, that's connected to a charge controller over here. Let me just get that in focus. Um, and the charge controller is connected to a little solar panel over here. So the mechanism is also driven by solar power, which is nice. And this is, a, this is only the first one that we have. We're gonna put put more uh, linear actuators and sensors on each of these rows. It's about more. It's about ten ten more. Um, but yeah, this is our solar tracking system.